so in today's video we are going to talk about mailchimp it's an online marketing platform where you can sell more with emails automations win repeat business with predictive segmentation engage more customers with standout emails improve your marketing results with suggestion based on what they know work best they will help you create click worthy content with their insights and drag and drop design tools you can also engage with more customers so without delaying it let's start our video and get into our mailchimp tutorial mailchimp automated emails to new subscribers hey guys in this video i am gonna be showing you how you can send automated emails to new subscriber on your mailing list using mailchimp so let's get into now mailchimp is a email marketing software where you just have to sign up with your email and your first name now after you have signed up on mailchimp this is going to be your basic dashboard and your basic dashboard you are going to find some of your web performance if you have a website and all of your general account details now on your left uh, you have your navigation bar where you have your create section then you have your audience then you have your campaigns you have automations you have websites then you have your content studio your interrogation and your search and below that you have your general account settings now let's say you have new email english people so let's say uh, you go into your audience list so add different contacts and then you want to add an automated email to everyone that adds to your contact or create or sign up for this sign or interacts with the social post so if you want to create a customized and a simple automated email you can easily do that with mailchimp and i'm going to show you how so first off let's say that you create a sign up a sign in form so you are just going to click on create form and then it can be pop-up form you are gonna click on begin and then these people are going to sign up and your website or whatever platform you are using i already have a mailchimp website so i'm just gonna add the mailchimp pop-up form to the website that i already have and then just going to click on edit i'm going to enable the pop-up form like this and then once i have done that i'm just going to click on save and exit now my pop-up form has been added now the second thing the you need to do is to create your customer journey so how to create an automated email the first thing you need to do is click on the create section over here and you can start off by creating your first email if you want you can spend more time on creating your email and then kind of email that you want i would suggest go with the template just click on the template over here and click on get started pick out a template customize it and then start your customer journey or your email journey from there because the templates provided by mailchimp are pretty great they are pretty nice and simple to understand and you are going to be able to find a very large variety of designs so let's say that we just have a basic welcome email or we have a basic postcard so let's keep on looking until i find a template that i actually like i'm going to keep it simple and use the basic event newsletter so or the event template so i'm going to open this uh, and what i am going to do is i am going to automate my email so you can spend some time on the design of the template you are going to add different blocks and you can change style from over here you just have to drag and drop blocks that you want if you want to add a new text section you are just going to drag the header and go on to the block section drag the text over here and then you can add another text block over here but i'm just going to click on save and exit because i'm just using this as a simple automation sample because i am just using this as a sample automation sample and i'm just going to save this uh, i have done that what i am going to do is i'm going to go on my or on to my automation section now i'm just going to click on automation over here and you are going to go to your customer journeys and now what you can do is you are going to click on create journey over here and now you are going to create a map of your context journey so the first thing you need to do is create the name for this entire automation so if this is a welcome automation so i'm just going to name this as an automation example so it's easier for you guys to understand how you are going to set this up but this is just going to be your automation example and i am going to choose the starting point uh, so what is going to be the starting point for this uh, to happen now there are many different sections on your left over here and it could be a content activity it could be dating special events it could be shopping activity it could be marketing activity 
or it could be a api interrogation because this is a event notification i am going to click on it i am going to click on the content activity and maybe when someone signs up uh, i want to always offer them this event i am going to click on include imported contacts and i am going to click on save uh, the sign up or signing up uh, point or the starting point so every time someone signs up to become my audience on the pop-up form that i created so what it should trigger is the email that i want so i'm just gonna click on send email you are gonna drag and drop it over here uh, you are gonna find it on your left side you are gonna drag and you have the send email section you can drag it over here so every time someone signs up they are going to get this event email and then what i can do is get a uh, time delay so after a time delay i'm going to drop this and over here i'm going to add my time delay and let's say after five days they get another email regarding the event or as a reminder it's gonna add this over here and then i can add it else block as well so if i add a else block like this now if the contact is let's say if they open up or let's say if they did not open up the email for the last five campaigns so if they don't open up the email what i can do is i can send them a discount email and i can send them over here or what i can do is i can unsubscribe them as well so you can choose how you want to build your journey from here on out depending on what kind of business you are running and what kind of automation you are looking for but it's pretty simple and easy to set these categories and the else block is the most important in your automation so if you are able to get that off correctly so if it matches any of these condition if uh, the campaign activity is not monitored or let's say if the email client is a iphone user maybe i want to provide them with a special discount for apple products or if they are not then i can provide them with a special discount for uh, for the android products or a window products so you can add those conditions and what you are going to do is once you have done this you have created your own automated email so this is how easy it is to set up your own automated emails using mailchimp i hope you guys found this video helpful and you are now able to send emails automatically using mailchimp however this is one drawback is that the email automation function on mailchimp is not available for free so if you go on to the pricing section of mailchimp you are going to find that the mailchimp domain website builder forms and landing pages of that stuff is free but the actual custom journey builder or email automation you actually have to sign up for at least the essential version which starts at ten dollars you can't just find discount but currently it's selling for ten dollars and you are uh, you are gonna be able to only send automated emails by this package of mailchimp we are about to end this uh, video and end it on a good note i would like to request you guys that if you found this video helpful or if you found this method exactly what you wanted or what you were looking for so please give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel and i will catch you guys in the next video